Farland Cougars had the same dream and they chased it to Sacramento in search of the school's first state championship in girls basketball and it looked like the whole town was at Golden One Center in support of their team. The ladies would ultimately fall to Oakland 51 to 35, but not without leaving their hearts on the court. Something coach Sam Diego hoped his ladies would do while enjoying the journey just like he did when he brought McFarland home a state title in cross country back in 1987. Even though we lost, or even if we would have won, we know that we would have had their support no matter what. I mean, just to have those stands, them cheering 24-7, um, them going out of their way, coming um, to all the way to Sacramento. I mean, it was just an, an amazing feeling, and I know none of us will ever forget that. I won in 87, got fifth in uh, my sophomore year. I got fifth my junior year, second my senior year in state. And so uh, with that in mind, I wanted the girls to experience and enjoy and just uh, just experience the whole ambiance and, and playing at this level, and they did. I've always said God was the author of a story, and so I guess, you know what, but I tell you what, I got a feeling other chapters are to come pretty soon. Emotional loss for this team, but this group of ladies had so much support during and after the game as they still remain the only girls basketball team to have played in a state championship and likely not the last.